In this video, I'm gonna reveal the secret to mastering blockchain. And it may not be what you think, so you're gonna to wanna to stick around for this video to find out, all right? So if you're new around here, hey, I'm Gregory from Dapp University. On this channel, I teach you how to become a blockchain developer. So if that's something that you're interested in, then click the like button down below and click subscribe, all right? So what is the key to mastering blockchain? Well, I've been thinking about this a lot because I'm actually in the middle of creating something very special for you. All right, if you didn't catch my last video, uh, I'm releasing my blockchain accelerator on January 29th, 2020, just in time for the new year. It's gonna put you on the fast track to mastering blockchain. I'm gonna put a link down below where you can sign up. Uh, I'm gonna be sending out some surveys because I wanna hear from you because I wanna create this program especially for you. So I've been thinking a lot uh, as I've been creating this accelerator on how to master blockchain and the problems that people face whenever they go down that road. All right, so I wanna talk about that problem and really focus in on it, all right? So if you're a complete beginner, you know, you're probably just like searching around the, on the internet, like what programming languages should I learn? Um, you know, how does a blockchain even work? That's really like step zero, right? But once you've moved on to that and you've actually gone down that road of trying to learn blockchain, um, there's a special spot where a lot of people get stuck that creates a problem. And this is what I wanna focus in on, all right? So I'm gonna pull a whiteboard up here on my screen. Um, so essentially, like whenever somebody kind of graduates from step zero, they, they know what languages they need to learn, they know what they need to do, and they start doing it. So they start doing tutorials, right? But there's a problem here, all right? Whenever they finish the tutorial, or even if they do finish it at all, they usually just bounce around to like another tutorial, right? And they don't really uh, move on from that, and they don't get much better. So don't get me wrong, like tutorials are great. Right, I, I put out a lot of tutorials. I just released a new three hour tutorial on how to become a blockchain developer and build a decentralized social network step by step. So tutorials are great, don't get me wrong. But if you don't move on from tutorials, you can get stuck in what I call, uh, let's see here if I can edit this. Tutorial hell, <laughs> right? And this is a place you do not want to get stuck because it's gonna prevent you from you know achieving your bigger goals you know, whatever they are. Maybe your goal is to get a blockchain developer job or to become a freelancer or just build your own real world project and actually master blockchain, all right? So whatever those goals are, uh, you have to realize that the tutorials are not the end goal that you actually have to get to these bigger goals. And this is where I see a lot of people get stuck because they get stuck in tutorial hell and they don't ever really move on to meet those other goals. So let me tell you the key to breaking out of this, right? Escaping tutorial hell, moving on to blockchain mastery. I think the biggest solution for this is to learn among a community. Here's why. When you're just doing tutorials online, you're usually just learning by yourself. All right, this is a perfectly valid way to learn, don't get me wrong. I actually prefer to learn this way on my own. But for many people, they just get stuck here, right? They might simply lose motivation uh, because it takes discipline to learn and to become a developer. Uh, they might get stuck on problems that they don't know how to solve and they just give up. Uh, or they feel like uh, they're not really in it with somebody else. They don't have other people who are on the same journey as them kind of helping them carry along to this mission of mastering blockchain. So here's how a community can help this, all right? So you can be motivated by one another, by other people who are on the same mission as you. They can help you, you know, stay disciplined and actually achieve your learning goals. Uh, you're gonna be on the same, you're gonna be learning the same kinds of things together. So you're gonna be able to actually bounce ideas off of one another and see what other people are struggling with. And you're gonna be able to help each other actually learn. All right, and sometimes it's actually better to get help from somebody else who's in a similar position to you, who just learned the thing you're trying to learn, another beginner, uh, because they remember exactly what it's like to be in your situation. They remember what it's like uh, to know nothing. It's fresh in their mind, and they say, oh, hey, this is what helped me, this will probably help you. So sometimes when you're around somebody who knows like 10 times what you know, uh, it can be challenging because they forget what it's like to be in your shoes, and they don't always see like what clicks, okay? So if you're like me, you didn't really get this when you went to school. Sure, a regular classroom is a learning community because it's a bunch of people together, uh, but students weren't always really motivated to learn stuff inside of a classroom like when I went to school, right? Either in, in regular school or in college, university. Um, you know, they were basically told they had to go to school and that wasn't really a lot of motivation for them to learn, right? But 
people who want to become developers, especially blockchain developers, are a lot different. They see a huge benefit to it, becoming in demand, you know, commanding high wages, being on the cutting edge of technology, right? If you can get around a community of people like that, it's going to be way different from a, another type of learning community that you're used to in a, tra- in a regular school uh, because people are passionate about what they're learning, right? They actually want to help each other out and achieve their goals of becoming uh, you know, masters in blockchain. That's the kind of community that you want to learn inside of, right? That's what's going to help you get unstuck, get out of this tutorial hell and actually achieve your goals. So you can create this for yourself, right? You can find other people who are on this path to you. You can, you know, give each other your Telegram usernames and message each other back and forth. Um, You know, somebody else has a similar vision and you can be a part of an online forum or something like that. But this type of ultimate learning community that I'm talking about where there's passionate people who are together on this same quest to like become master blockchain developers is the kind of thing that I'm trying to create inside my accelerator. And I want to tell you another aspect about that that can really, you know, 10x the results of a learning community like this. And this is another key factor, all right, to getting unstuck out of this tutorial hell and onto the path of mastering blockchain. And that's expertise, okay? So sure, you can be a part of a community where a lot of other people are learning together, uh, but you also want some people inside of that community who are way ahead of where you are (laughs) on your quest uh, to becoming a blockchain developer, all right? You don't want to just pool the wisdom of people who are brand new. Um, You need somebody, at least one person who can say, hey, this is wrong and this is right, you know, based on experience. And trust me, the eyes of an expert are invaluable. Like if you're stuck on a coding problem, uh, someone who's a master can just look at the problem and instantly say, oh, hey, this is wrong. And poof, they've completely solved it, saving you hours of frustration. Or if you're stuck on a concept, a true expert can identify your misunderstanding instantly and completely clear up your misunderstanding. And the best kind of expert is someone who's done the thing that you're trying to do. So if you're trying to learn blockchain, you want to learn from an actual blockchain developer. All right. And this is a huge problem for me, like when I went to school. All right. So most of my professors or my teachers weren't actually people who like did the thing that I was trying to learn in the real world. Okay. So I'm not knocking teachers. Um, I had a lot of great teachers, a lot of great people. So I don't want to like throw them under the bus in this video. Um, I owe so much to them, but I arguably learned way more from people who gave me hands-on instruction towards the things that I was trying to learn, like people who could actually do the thing that I was trying to learn. And I saw this a lot from my other students in my classes when I was going through school is that like, they didn't look up to their teachers, right? They looked up to other people, maybe like sports athletes or something like that. Like, can you imagine how much they'd be willing to learn from somebody like that? Because the person that they would learn from embodied the state that they wanted to get to. And that's a huge critical role of a learning community. So you want to be with other people who are on the same path as you, with the same relative experience as you, trying to achieve the same goals. But you also want to have experts inside that community who can keep you on the right track. You don't want to be headed north when you should be going south. Uh, you know, they want to keep you on the right track and also help you get unstuck in places where you know, other beginners can't quite do that. And having a community like this is going to help you get unstuck, help you get out of tutorial hell and achieve your bigger goals uh, with blockchain development, whatever they are, whether you're trying to get a job, become a freelancer, build your own real world projects, just to master blockchain. Um, This is going to help you get there. And so you can create something like this for yourself. You can find friends who want uh, to go down the same path. You can try to find other blockchain developers. Uh, But I'm trying to create this for you, all right, inside this blockchain accelerator that's coming out on uh, January 29th, 2020. All right, I'm gonna put a link down below uh, where you can sign up. Again, I'm gonna be sending out some surveys uh, where I want your input. I'm trying to create this especially for you. So I want your feedback. All right. So hope you all like this video. Again, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Click the like button down below. And until next time, Thanks for watching DAP University.